brought to you by Plan. It's a nice fish. Nice striker. It is a nice fish. Not bad. Look at that bruiser. This segment brought to you by Brayville. You're watching In Fisherman. From the editors of In Fisherman Magazine, the most experienced staff in all outdoors. With editor in chief Doug Stangy, Rob Newman, Steve Quinn, and Jeff Simpson, along with In Fisherman publisher Steve Hoffman. I could never get enough of this. Fish holding in deep water require precision depth control. Most anglers have seen downriggers in action, typically in conjunction with another precision trolling tool, the line counter reel. A lure goes back a set distance, and then the line is placed in a release just above the downrigger ball, which then is lowered to the target depth. As the rod's placed in the holder, the trap is set, and anglers can go about the business of monitoring electronics for bait fish and striped bass. And before long... Well, these rods have done it. This is the first time I've used these for the stripers. They're, they're doing a good job. I like them for the down rigging. I'm going to get me a couple of them. Tiger rods. Really likes the tip on them. We're ready for the net. All right, let's get it. Slack. <clears throat> there, oh, there you got them. <laughs> oh, man. Nice He's bigger than I thought. Great start to the morning right there. <laughs> We're started. Nice <laughs> fish. Beaver Lake, Arkansas with guy Mike Bailey. And this is always exciting for me because I don't get to fish with stripers all that often. And, but I've done it all across the country and have gotten some big fish. This is not a giant, but it's a good start for the morning. And actually, I love to eat stripers too, so we're going to save this one. We're going to put, put him in the box and, and hope for bigger fish as we go on. But the whole deal today is, uh, you know, there's so many different ways to fish with stripers. Down here in, in particular, it's a live bait thing, and you do the live bait thing, you know. But there's also very precision ways to fish for stripers with bugs, and that's what we're doing. We're doing the downrigger thing, staying close to structure, over trees a lot of times. And a little bit later on, we might try some other precision techniques, but we'll stay with the downrigging if that's what's working. Put this guy in the box. We are started. Just very quickly, your favorite plugs for this trolling. That's a number 14 Husky Jerk. That's an all-time favorite of mine, too, man. It's a great plug. Oh, it works wonders out here on this lake. There's no action like it in any other lure. And we're running the two lower lines about 150 back and the other lines about 100 back. So pretty standard downrigging setup. Let's get back at it. <clears throat> there we are. Ooh, little striper. Little guy, huh? Yep. <laughs> Welcome aboard, little guy. And we got another one for the box. <laughs> Tasty. Be a happy guy tonight. So when you're trolling so tight to this stuff, you're looking for trees along the bank or on a what? I'm just watching the bluff line here, and there's a tree line that runs along the bluff. There's a shelf along the uh, main channel that cuts in near the bluff. And uh, bait's typically holding in the area. And uh, we just try to get the lures in as close as we can to mimic what that bait's doing. So you're actually running the downrigger balls right up against the trees a lot? As close as we can get. Right. You bet you, if we're not losing tackle, we're not in the right area. We'll sit back up and hope we can get in some bigger fish here. No, here we go. Ooh. Nice fish. You should probably pop that and take it out. Hey, very exciting. Here he is. There we go. That's a nice fish there. Oh, yeah. Beauty. That's a decent fish. Give some line. Give some line. Got him? Yep. Good job. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> a big one. Look at the size out. of that dude. I knew Beaver had some big ones. But that's, uh, that's cool, man. Right. Here's some pliers for you. It's right up under your heel there. Yeah. <laughs> pliers? We'll give a quick fish hole here. Oh. That's a nice fish. Nice striker. That is a nice fish. Not bad. Look at that bruiser. <laughs> Beautiful. Huh. Well, you know, it's precision fishing. 
you know, uh, there's so many different situations when this actually works. What's it, before we leave the people, what's the best time frame here on Beaver for these? Oh, you're looking at the warmer water months, uh, usually June, July, August, when the fish are really active. So the precision fishing works in certain situations. There's great live bait fishing all across the country. The downriggers will work in any situation like this where you need precise depth, precise speed control, or pre precise precision next to structure like the trees that we've got right here. Very cool. Thank you very much. We'll come That's back next pleasure. This segment. This segment brought to you by Gulf Alive. For more information about InFisherman, visit us at in-fisherman.com.